me llegan ingresos ahorita. Hola, hola, ingeniero, ¿qué precios son los que están malos? Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, everybody. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Excellent. I'm fine, Aved. I'm glad to hear you. And Sulma Gonzalez, good evening. Hola, buenas noches. How are you? ¿Qué tal? Bien, bien, bien. Qué bueno, me alegra. ¿Qué tal estuvo el trabajo? Pues gracias a Dios, ahí siempre con diferentes casos cada día, pero gracias a Dios todo bien. Ok, that's nice. Dalia Margarita, good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Great. How, How was your day? You? I'm fine. It was Thanks. okay. All right. Did you have to work today? Yeah, it was a tough day. Okay. All right. Good. Mm. Thanks. Jose Abel, good evening. Buenas noches. How are you? ¿Qué tal? Muy bien. Llegando a casa hace un Quizás un par de minutos. Ah, bueno, un día muy cansado, me imagino. Sí, corriendo con el tráfico siempre. Oh, that's Pero terrible. Ya estamos aquí para, para aprender. Qué bueno. Eso, welcome, José Abel. And Frank, good evening. Good evening, everybody. How are you, Frank? Yeah. I'm very fine. I'm very happy to be with you again. Great. That's nice. How was your day? I'm very busy. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can imagine. All right. And how about Arnoldo Morales? Good evening, Arnoldo. Casi no lo oigo bien. Oh, maybe it's Habla, the connection. Todo, todo. todo. Eh, hoy sí ya la oigo, pero no sé qué es lo que me decía. How are you? I'm fine. Excellent. I'm glad to hear you. Alfonso Antonio, good evening. Good evening, everybody. How are you? Fine. Great. That's very nice. How was your day? How was your day? Um, Es, es soso. ¿Soso? Más o menos. Ok. Tuve un problema, tuve un problema la avenida. Lamentablemente me picó una abejita en la oreja oh. y tocó correr a ponerme una inyección por lo de la alergia. Oh, you have an allergy. That's pretty bad. Eso es malo. Yeah. Entonces, pero gracias a Dios llegamos a tiempo. Y... No fue respiratorio, oh. eso fue más que todo comezón. Oh. Pero igual, es incómodo. Of course. Uh, so, one question, please. Uh, one moment. 
Tell me. <coughs> Dígame. Eh, en la mañana temprano, en español, en la mañana temprano intenté este, entrar a la plataforma, pero tuve problemas y me intenté comunicar con los compañeros eh, que nos están colaborando, pero no me respondieron. Ah, ok. Fíjese que hemos estado bastante saturados. Como hay inicios de cursos, pues son varios cursos los que estamos atendiendo. Entonces, eh, los compañeros de, de asistencia técnica igual están bastante ocupados y es por eso que se están tardando un poquitín en responder. Pero esperaría yo que el día de mañana puedan resolverle. Ok. Sí, sí. es que eh, me parecía... Eh, bueno, cuando entré a la plataforma, me parece que le mandé la imagen, decía de que... Eh, estaba registrado, pero como asistente. Entonces, lo que había hecho en la mañana no me lo tomaba como, como el puntaje, por así decirlo. O sea, no, no me iba grabando todo lo que iba haciendo. Ok, no sé si los demás se han fijado cómo les aparece. Les, no sé si les aparece igual a todos. A mí también me dio error, no me permitió ingresar ni nada, o sea, me decía que no estaba inscrito en ningún grupo. No pudo entrar, Dalia. Okay. No, nada. no había ingresado anteriormente. No, hasta ahora que quería realizar la tarea y eso, pero de igual manera me decía que no estaba registrada y también yo estoy tratando de contactar al personal. Pero no, no me contestaron. Vaya, entonces igual si ya ustedes enviaron el mensajito, eh, como les digo, mañana espero yo que les puedan responder para que les ayuden por ahí. No se preocupen, ahí vamos a estar pendientes. Igual cualquier cosa me escriben a mí mañana y yo lo reporto también para que estén un poco pendientes ahí. Eh, buenas noches. Buenas noches, José Manuel. Este, yo sí pude, pude ingresar pero lo que dice, lo que dice eh, un compañero es correcto que le aparece a uno como que, como que ha entrado como asistente y que por lo tanto como que no tiene uno derecho a lo que es este, el diploma que se otorga a la hora de culminar el, el módulo no sé, no sé por qué tira ese mensaje pero sí pude ingresar a lo que es la plataforma, pero sí envía ese mensaje. Y aparece uno como asistente. Ok, eh, vaya, igual voy a consultarlo yo el día de mañana y cualquier cosa pues les aviso por la noche en la conferencia. Ok, so... Okay, gracias. So, good evening everybody, welcome. And now we may start with our class. So, get this. Let's start with a little review of what we studied yesterday. What did we study? De lo que estudiamos ayer, ¿qué se recuerdan? Verb We studied the verb be. Okay. So, what do you remember about the verb be? Los, de los personal pronouns, I am, you are, it is, she is. Okay, so first of all, we studied the personal pronouns. Which ones are the personal pronouns in English? I. I, <clears throat> sorry, I, and what else? You. 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 It. She. She. He, 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 she, 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 it, it, we, 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 they, and they, right? And just remember they. that we have um, two different kinds of you. We can use it in the singular form or we can use it in the plural form, right? Mm. To refer to one person, right. like when I say you are Sulma, right? I'm referring to Suma, only one person. But then if I say you are my students, that will be the plural form. Okay, so what else did we study? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más recuerdan de la clase de ayer? Uh, uh, 
there be? The verb be. I am. Okay, that will be the affirmative form, yes. right? Yeah. We say I am. What else? Um, you, you are. are. You are. You are. He is. He is. He is. She is. He is. 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 He is. It is. It is. It is. We are. We are in. They are. They are. They are, right? Very good. And we also had some contracted forms, right? Do you remember them? Contracted uh, forms? Yes. Yeah. Um, 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 you. Okay, so we have I'm, I'm, I, I'm, your, 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 your she she is, 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 what else? She is, she is, she is, it, is, it, it, where, 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 and there, 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 there. Okay, let's stop over here and let's practice pronunciation. Please repeat after me. I, 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 I you, 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 he, he, he she, 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 it, 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 we, we, we they, 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 I am. I am. I am. You are. You, you are. are. He is. He is. He is. He is. He is. He is. She is. She, she is. is. It is. It, it is. is. We are. We, we are. are. They are. They, they are. are. Now the contracted contracted forms. I'm. I'm. I'm your. 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 His. Yes. His. She's. 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 It's. It's. it's we're. 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 we're there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now tell me how to make sentences in the affirmative form using the verb be, of course. What do we have for the affirmative statements? Any ideas how to make sentences? Para hacer oraciones? Que necesito? Como les... I am a worker. Okay. Give me another example, please. Yeah. She's a teacher. She is beautiful. She is beautiful. Or she is a teacher too. He is my father. He is my father. Any other? Um, you, my friend. They, you are my friend. They are. They are friends. They are friends. What else? We are uh, engineers. We are. We are what? We are. An engineer. Engineers, or what do you? Yes. Mean? Okay. Good. All right. Very good. So that's how we make affirmative statements using the verb be. Right. We first need a subject. I, she, he, you, they, we, or any name of a person, any animal or thing. Then we need the verb be 
in the forms am, is, or are, depending on the subject. And after that, we add a complement, right? I am a worker, she is beautiful, she is a teacher. And also remember that we can use the contracted forms. And we change the sentences from I am a worker to I'm a worker, right? I'm a worker. She's beautiful, she's a teacher, he's my father, you're my friend, they're friends, and we're engineers, right? So from these two words, you make only one and it sounds shorter. Okay, so now let's talk about the negative form. What can you tell me about that? What do you remember? In negative form. Send a subject and verbi. Okay, so and that is very good. That is for the sentences, right? We use the subject, the verbi, and then the not. Then the complement. Okay, that is to make sentences. And now tell me about the forms for the negative of the verb be. What do we have? What's the negative of I am? I, I, am, I am not. not. We say I am not. You. You are not. You are not. You are not. Are not. You are he is not. He is not. He is not. She is not. She is not. It is not. It is not. It is not. We. It is not. What do we say there? We. We are not. Are not. We. They. We are not. We are not. Are not. And also remember yeah, that we right have now. the contracted forms, right? Which ones do we have? Contractions. Or I am not. We can say. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Okay. I'm not. You are not would be. Right. You aren't. You aren't or you're not, right? And for he is not, we have? He isn't. He isn't. He isn't. He isn't. Or he's not. The same for she, right? She is not, she isn't. She isn't. She isn't. She's, she's, she's not. not. It. What would be the contraction for it is it isn't. not? Isn't. Isn't, once again. And we could also say it's not. It's not. It's not. Or we are not, we have? We, we aren't. aren't. We aren't. Yeah. Uh, we're not. Or we're not. We're, we're not. not. Even aren't. for they, we got they aren't. They aren't. aren't. They not. Or they are they're not. not. They're not. They're not. Now they tell me some not. sentences. Tell me some sentences in the negative. Mm -hmm. I am not a lawyer. I am not a lawyer. What else? You she are not a singer. You are not a singer. The other? She is not a doctor. She is not a doctor. She is not a secretary. She is not a secretary. Any other? We are not lazy people. We are not lazy people. Great. Any the other? In the? 
engineer. They are not. They are not engineers. Okay, good. Now let's practice pronunciation. Repeat after me. I am not. I am not. I am not. I am not. 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 You are not. <coughs> you are not. not. You aren't. You, you aren't. You aren't. You are not. You are not. You are not. He is not. He is not. He is not. He isn't. He isn't. He's not. He's not. She is not. She is not. She isn't. She isn't. She's not. She's not. It is not. It is not. No. It isn't. It isn't. It's not. It is it's not. not. We are not. We are not. We are not. We aren't. We aren't. We're not. We're not. not. They are not. They are not. They are not. They aren't. They, they, they are not. They are not. They are not. They are not. Perfect. So now let's continue with our next activity. Okay. Let's talk a little bit about occupations. So tell me, what occup occupations do you know in English? Secretary. Doctor. Okay, secretary. Doctor. Lawyer. Lawyer. Accountant. Accountant. Nurseman. Nurse. Policeman. Nurse. Policeman. Project manager. Project manager. Carpenter. Carpenter. Driver. Driver or truck driver. Good. Any other? Grave digger. Can you repeat that one? Grave digger. Grave digger. Grave digger. Chef. Salesman. Chef. Salesman. Engineer. Engineer. Other, think about it. Scientist, journalist, journalist. I heard another one. What was it? Actor, scientist, actor, actor. actor. We also got painter, painter. What else? Finder. Finger. Finger. Any other you remember? Dentist. Dentist, of course. Uh, okay. Housewife. Housewife. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Soldier. Soldier. Art, architect. Architect. Major. Architect. I can't remember how to spell it. Check. What was the other one? Major. And major. Sure. Any other? Uh, Can you model. Can you repeat that? Model. Attorney. Oh, model. Yes. What was the other? Attorney. Um. Can you repeat it, please? I didn't get it. Sorry. Pharmacist. Pharmacist. Sorry, I couldn't get that. 
Um, can you write it on the chat, please? You can type it on the chat. I didn't get it. Okay. Must be sure. The economist. Economist, sure. Okay, so let's keep the list until here. Now let's practice pronunciation. Please repeat after me. Secretary. 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 Doctor. 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 Teacher. 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 Lawyer. 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 Accountant. 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 Nurse. No. Nurse. Nurse. Policeman. 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 Project manager. Project manager. Carpenter. 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 Driver. 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 Grave digger. Grave digger. digger. Chef. Uh, chef. 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 Salesman. 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 Engineer. Engineer. Journalist. 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 Actor. 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 Painter. Singer. Singer. Dentist. Dentist. Housewife. Housewife. Soldier. Soldier. Architect. Mayor. Mayor. Model. Model. Economist. Economist. All right, good. Let me give you one minute if you'd like to copy any of those so you have them for you to practice the vocabulary. Um, yeah. Let's just take one minute so you can copy them if you'd like to have the list. Okay, let me know when we're ready to continue. Are we ready to continue? Did you finish? Yes. Yes. Very good. So we may continue now. Now let's talk about today's topic. We are going to learn how to make yes, no questions with the verb be. So let me explain it. First of all, we have, for example, uh, 
a sentence with the verb be. And um, tell me a sentence with the verb be, just a random sentence. Sentence, sentence, sentence. An affirmative sentence or an affirmative statement. She is an excellent student. Is an excellent student. Okay, so there we have the sentence, right? In order to make a yes-no question, we have to change the order of the elements. So instead of saying she is, we are going to put the verb be first, and it becomes is she an excellent student? And then the question mark. Is mm -hmm. she an excellent student? That's how we make them, right? So we only change yes. the order of the first two elements, right? Instead of starting with the subject, we start with the verb be, and then we get this structure. Is she an excellent student? And also we could say, we could say are you an accountant? Is she your sister? Are they your parents? And so on. So that's how we make the yes, no questions. Okay, let me tell you about the use of the verb be to ask the yes, no questions. And we ask about the identity or description of a person, place, or thing, as in the following example. Am I your friend? Am I your friend? We also have, is it a good restaurant? Is it a good restaurant? Are these islands Greek? Are these islands Greek? So those will be some examples on how to make questions with the verb be. Then how to answer las respuestas. Do you know how to answer to this? Am I your friend? What may yes, we say? Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. Yes, I am or yes. I am not. What do you say? Oh, yeah. Okay, oh, no, so am. there's a little trick over here with the, the subjects I and you, right? So if I ask you, am I your friend? Am I your friend? You may say, yes. I you are. You are, right? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Or if I make it negative, it will become, no. You aren't. No, you aren't. You aren't or you're not. Okay, we also have long answers. So those are the short answers that we may provide. And we also have some other options that are the long answers. So what will be the long answer for this? Am I your friend? You are my friend. Yes, you are my friend. Or no. You are not my friend. You are not my friend or you aren't my friend. So it could be a short answer or a long answer. Tenemos dos opciones para responder las preguntas. La primera sería la respuesta corta, que es nada más yes you are or no you aren't. Y luego tenemos la respuesta larga. Yes, you are my friend, or no, you are not my friend. Y luego acá el cambio de sujetos lo hacemos dependiendo de, de la lógica, ¿verdad? Si yo le pregunto, am I your friend? Yo soy tu amigo. Sí, tú eres, me va a decir, ¿verdad? O pues sí, usted es, right? Usted es mi amigo. Entonces, en esos sujetos sí hay que tener cuidado que cuando, normalmente cuando las preguntas van con you, Como si le pregunto, are you a doctor? Are you a doctor? Me va a responder, yes, I am, or no, I am not. De igual forma, si la pregunta va con I, normalmente respondemos utilizando el pronombre you. Okay, then we have the second example. Is it a good restaurant? Is it a good restaurant? What would be the answers for that one? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Or no, 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 it's not. It's not or it isn't, right? 
Okay, then we have the long answers that would be. Is it a good restaurant? Yes. It is a good restaurant. It is a good restaurant. Uh, no. 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 It is. No. It isn't a good restaurant. No, no, it's not. Okay, and the last question we have are these Greek are uh, these islands Greek? Yes. How do we answer are. that one? Yes, they yes, are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Or no? They are not. They are not. Okay, and tell me about the long answers. What do we say there? Yeah. Yes, they are yeah. the island Greek. They are the Greek islands. Greek islands. In this case, we changed the order. Greek islands. We could also they, say they're... They are not Greek islands. They are not Greek islands. Okay, so that is what we have for the, the yes, no questions and their answers. Some important things to remember about. And first of all, the punctuation, it should always be like this. Yes, comma, you are, and then the period. La puntuación, siempre utilizamos el yes o no, una comita, y al final, you are, you aren't, un punto, ¿verdad? And también es importante recalcar que acá en las respuestas cortas, que son afirmativas, no se puede utilizar la forma contractada por ejemplo no sería posible decir yes your that is incorrect esa respuesta sería incorrecta entonces no debemos utilizarlo de esa forma se puede utilizar las formas contractadas en el negativo you aren't you're not is fine pero en el afirmativo no podemos utilizar las contracciones Okay, so let's continue. Let me raise this. Okay, a second use for the verb be with for the verb be in questions would be to use it with a preposition to ask yes no questions about a present or past location. For example, when I say am I at the park? También podemos utilizar estas preguntas para hablar de location, de la ubicación o del lugar donde algo está o alguien está. For example, when I ask, am I at the park? Am I at the park? Are the keys under the books? Are the keys under the books? Is your, is your house downtown? It should be, sorry, I made a mistake there. Let me write it over here. Is your house downtown? Goodness. Okay, there you go. So those are the examples we have. Now let's practice how to answer. So if I say, am I at the park? What would be the answer? Yes, I am. Yes, you are. Yes, you are, right? Just remember about yes. that detail. I, you, okay? Both subjects go almost together, let's say. So, yes, you are or no, you aren't. Okay, are the keys under the books? What do we say there? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. No, they are not. No, they are not. 
And in the last one, is your house downtown? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Or no, it is no, it is not. It is not. Perfect. Okay, so do we have any questions so far? Tenemos alguna consulta? Estamos bien hasta acá? We're good. Yes? I see some people look confused. So tell me. Díganme. No sé si me van entendiendo. Necesitamos regresar en algún punto. O seguimos y vamos practicando y vamos a ir viendo también cómo se aplica. So, may we continue? continuar y ver la aplicación. Perfect. Okay, so let me continue by telling you about the structure and some examples. We are going to make some examples all together. So, oh. so here, as I told you before, we start with the verb B. Then we have the subject. After the subject, we need the complement, and that's pretty much it. And then it's very important to put the question mark at the end. Para hacer las, las preguntas tenemos tres elementos. El primero sería el verb be. Recordemos que ya no iniciamos con el sujeto, sino que con el verb be. Luego agregamos el sujeto y al final el complemento. También es importante siempre poner el signo de interrogación para identificar la, o para marcarla como pregunta. ¿verdad? Then let's make some examples. Are you a lawyer? Are you a lawyer? Can you make some others? A ver, ayúdenme a hacer más preguntas, por favor. Are you angry? Are you angry? Any other? Are they happy? Are they happy? How about we make some using is? Is? Is it great? Can you repeat that? Is it great? Is it great? Is that what you said? Yeah. Okay. Another is one he is, a doctor? Is she a doctor? Very good. Any other? Is it is? Is he your father? Is he your father? Okay. And let's make one using M. Um. Any ideas? Play. Am I? Am I in the park? Am I in the park? Good. Okay. Now let's practice the answers. How do you answer those questions? Are you a lawyer? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Or you may also answer. What would be the affirmative answer? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Are you angry? I no. I'm not, once I'm again. Not. Or yes, I am. Are they happy? How do we answer that? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Or? No, they aren't. No, they aren't. No, they aren't. Is it great? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Or no? It isn't. No, it isn't. It is not or it isn't. Is she a doctor? 
Yes. Yes, she is. She is. No, she is not or isn't. Is he your father? No. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Or no, no he, isn't. he isn't. And the last one, am I at the park or am I in the park? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Or no, you're not. Okay. Now repeat after me. Are you a lawyer? Are you a lawyer? Are you a lawyer? Are you a lawyer? No, I'm not. No, no I am not. not. Yes, I am. Yes, yes, I am. I am. Are you angry? No, I'm angry. angry. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm not. Yes, I am. Yes, yes, I, yes am. I am. Are they happy? Are, are they happy? They happy? happy? <laughs> yes, they are. Yes, yes they, they are. are. No, they aren't. No, no they, they aren't. aren't. Is it great? Is, Is it, it great? 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 Yes, it is. Yes, yes, it is. No, it is not. It no, is not. Is she a doctor? Is she, is she a doctor? Yes, she is. Yes, yes she, she is. is. No, she isn't. No, no she, she isn't. isn't. Is he your father? Is, is he your, he your father? father? Yes, he is. Yes, yes. He is. He is. no, he isn't. No, no he, he isn't. Am I in the park? Am I, I in, in the, the park? park? Yes, you are. Yes, yes you, you are. are. No, you're not. No, no you're, you're not. not. Okay. Lo importante acá a la hora de responder las preguntas es identificar el sujeto. Como se fijan, les hablaba de que cuando utilizamos you, normalmente respondemos con I. Y en caso opuesto, si tengo la pregunta con I, respondo con you. En el caso de los demás sujetos, voy a utilizar el mismo sujeto de la pregunta en la respuesta. Are they happy? Yes, they are. Eso debemos de cuidar siempre. O por ejemplo, si la pregunta es, is she a doctor? Yes, she is. No puedo responder con yes, he is, o yes, they are. No, tiene que ser siempre el mismo sujeto, ¿ok? All right, now let's continue with some practice. Now you are going to make yes, no questions using this information, this prompts. They and hungry. How do we make a question using that? They are hungry. Make a question. Oh, are, they are they hungry? Exactly, we say, are they hungry? Are they hungry? In the question mark. Okay, that is what I want you to do. Yes. So please take out your notebook or some paper you got there and you make the questions. Write them down, please. Mm -hmm. Les voy a dar unos minutos, van escribiendo las oraciones. Y luego vamos a chequearlas todos juntos.
Did you finish? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Finish her. Okay, great. Now let's check. We got number one, are they hungry? Number two? Are we late? Are we late? Okay, next one. Peter from England. What do we say? Peter from England. Is Peter from England? The boys at school. What do Are we the say? The boys at school. Are the boys at school? At school. Okay, then we got John in the garden. Is John in the garden? John in the garden. Is John in the garden? Next one. Are you tired? Are you tired? Are you tired? Okay, number seven. Is he French? Is he French? He's French. Is he French? Then we got Harry and Lucy from London. Are Harry and Lucy from London? Are Harry and Are they Lucy? from London? Okay, we may also say, are they from London? Next one. Am I early? Am I, Am I early? Number 10. Are you thirsty? Are you thirsty? Number 11 is? Is, is, is she, she in the bus? The bus? In the bus. Is she on the bus? And the last one is? Are the, are, children the children are the children at school? Are the children at school? Okay, good. And um, do we have any questions about the vocabulary? Tenemos alguna consulta en cuanto al, vocu al vocabulario, perdón. Conocen todas las palabras, tienen alguna pregunta? Do you know the meaning of late? ¿Qué significa late? Tarde. Tarde. Hungry. Hambriento. 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 Then garden. Jardín. 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 Okay. Tired. Cansado. Right. Early. Temprano. Temprano, thirsty. Sediento. 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 And I think you know the others, right? Okay, so now let's practice answering. And um, let me select one of you. And I'll. Perdón, Zulma, dígame. Eh, en la nueve, tengo una duda porque solo se pone el I y de respuesta I'm. I'm. No entiendo esa, esa parte en la 9, porque solo se pone la I y en la respuesta ya va I'm. Um, en esa puedo utilizar dos respuestas distintas. Podría ser, por ejemplo, am I early? Yes, I am. Sería la misma estructura que acá estamos usando, am I. Nada más que en la pregunta le damos vuelta, ¿verdad? Le cambiamos el orden. Y luego... En la respuesta negativa podríamos decir no, I am not. O también pudiera usar la respuesta contractada no, I am not. Pero en sí, ¿qué dice la 9? En ese caso ¿En no lo vamos a traducir como cero estar, sino más bien como llegué temprano. En ese caso, am I early, mm. llegué temprano. 
C, mm -hmm. no, right? Yep. Uh, bueno, pero esa era mi duda. Gracias, Miss. Ok. Sí, recordemos ahí que las formas contractadas eh, son nada más, más que todo para el lenguaje informal, ¿verdad? Es una forma uh -huh. de decir la misma cosa, pero de una forma más corta. Por ejemplo, cuando estoy hablando, es más largo, toma, digamos, más tiempo, por así decirlo, decir I am not a student, que decir I am not a student, I am not a student. Entonces, de esa forma yo hablo un poco más fluido. Esa es la idea de las contracciones. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok, bueno, entonces les decía que vamos a practicar las preguntas. Voy a escoger a uno de ustedes, le voy a hacer una de las preguntas, me da la respuesta corta, puede ser yes or no, y luego esa persona hace una pregunta a otro de los compañeros. Ok, so let me choose Frank. Frank, are they hungry? Yes, they are. Good. Now, Frank, ask the second question to somebody in the group. Uh, to Josue, Jose Manuel Grijalva. Uh, is Peter from England? No, I'm not. Again, Jose Manuel, is Peter from England? Is Peter from England? Oh, excuse me. Again. Is Peter from England? Okay, so there the answer has to be yes, he is, or no, he isn't, right? Or you could also say yes, Peter yes, is, yes, or yes, he is. Very good. Okay, now Jose Manuel, you ask another question to a classmate. Um, um, Susana Margarita. Okay, the question. Are the boys at school? Yes. Yes, your boy, the school. Okay, in that case you say yes, they are. Or you could also say yes, the boys are at school. Okay. Yes, they are. No, they're not. They are. Very good. Uh -huh. Okay. They are, they, mm -hmm. they are at school. Very good. Now, Susana, ask another question to one of your classmates, please. Yeah. French? To whom? Is he French? Eh, ¿A quién de los compañeros escoge? Frank. Frank. Tell me the question again, please. Por favor, la, la oración. ¿Cuál? Ah, is he French, eh, ¿verdad? Yes. Yes, he is. Very good. Frank, ask another person, please. Uh, Dalia Margarita Rodríguez. Is she, is she on the bus? Yes, she is. Okay, perfect. Continue asking. Uh, to Carlos Jose. Are the children at school? Yes, they are. Very good. Okay, so that is how we ask and answer. Hay que tener cuidado con las preguntas donde tenemos acá los sujetos como nombres, por ejemplo. Is Peter from England? Acá lo vamos a cambiar. Normalmente para responder vamos a cambiarlo al personal pronoun. He, en este caso. Is Peter from England? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Are the boys at school? ¿Cuál sería la respuesta? Yes, they are. Yes, they are, or no, they aren't. And let me see if we have another one. Yes, we got our Harry and Lucy from London. Yes, they are. They are. Yes, they are, no, they aren't. Okay, good. Now it's time to continue practicing in small groups. 
Vamos a trabajar al igual que ayer en grupos pequeños haciendo distintos ejercicios. Ahí nos ponemos de acuerdo con los compañeros y vamos completando. Exercise number one is about writing M, E, or R to complete the, the questions and then you have to write the affirmative and negative short answers. Acá vamos a completar primeramente utilizando am, um, is, or are. En la primera, ¿qué sería? Jane and Alice's sisters. What do we say? Are. Are. And we completed using are. Are Jane and Alice's sisters. And then we write both the affirmative and negative short answers. So that will be yes. They are, they are. And the negative one, no. No, they are not. They are not or they aren't. Okay, that's what you have to do in exercise number one. Now let me show you exercise number two. There you have to fill in the blanks. Acá vamos a completar. Siempre utilizando el verb be y luego vamos a completar la respuesta que en este caso es respuesta larga. For example, here, is that my pen? No. What do we say? It's not. No, it's not. It's not your pen. It's not your pen. Okay, next exercise is unscramble the questions and then you provide long, long answers. For example, number one, what's the question? Is your father from Canada? Is your father from Canada? And the long answer would be? Yes, he is from Canada. Yes, he is from Canada or no, he isn't from Canada. And our next one, we got four exercises. The last one is change the sentences to the interrogative form. So we got the books are in my bag. Make it a question, please. Are the books in my bag? Are the books in my bag? Pretty good, that's what you have to do. So let me send you to the breakout rooms right now. And I'm sending the exercises to the WhatsApp group once again. Is that good? Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, there you go. Let me open the rooms.
Scar. Is this car? Is this car yes. yours? Is this car your tuyo? Eh? Uh -huh. Is. Is this car yours, verdad? Exacto. Okay. And the words I need to word. Ah, sería is. No. I no. Sería. Um, Am I in your way? Am I Estoy your yo way? en tu camino? Ajá, am I, yes. Uh, way, way es camino. Sí, en tu camino. Ajá. Estoy en tu camino. Am uh -huh. I in your way? Am es entonces la tercera. Am, um, sí. Ajá, am I. Ajá, porque si, si es camino, sí, ¿verdad? Am sí. I. Ajá. María John Sister sería, la cuatro sería R, ¿verdad? The cuatro is is María is is sí. Sí, que yo pensé que era John, pensé que era otro nombre, pero no es la misma. Ah. Es María John Sister, es María John Sister. John Sister. Twenty-five years old. No, no, sería R. Cinco. Ajá, sí. Yo, ¿verdad? Are you, sí. Sería is, ¿verdad? Porque... Say, are. Es que son es una familia, entonces son varios, entonces are. Es are. Um, are the Smiths divorced? Ah, es una pareja, no, entonces, ¿no? Smith es, es este familia, no es no es nombre. No, Smith, ajá, pero ahí se refiere a son pareja. Es un oso era, Es un apellido. Ajá. Entonces sería R. R, ajá. Okay. This union biscuit, this union biscuit. Is is this your is this is this very right? is, is this your new bicycle? Uh -huh. Is this your new your new bicycle? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Is is también verdad? Is she? Uh huh. Sí, exacto. Mm -hmm. It and study. Sería am. Am I? Am I the stadium, verdad? Am I? Estoy en el estadio. Am I? Ahí estamos. Ahí estamos hablando de de nosotros, verdad? Susan and I. Susan and I. ¿Qué dices? Tú en I, verdad? Ajá. Entonces sería Ah, ah, uh -huh. uh -huh, exacto. Are Sue and I? The, the cell phone in the back.
Is Peter German? Mm -hmm. Is Peter German? No, he's not. No, he is not German. German. Perdón, ¿cómo era la cuatro? No. No, he is not German. Mm. Oh, he yes. isn't German. Arjani and Sally. Arjani mm -hmm. and Sally in, in the classroom. classroom. Yes, they are. Oh, yes, they are. Yes, they are in the classroom. In the classroom. Is Mr. Pearson late? No, he isn't late. Ah, bueno, ¿qué es eso? ¿Cómo es la seis? Sería, is Mrs. Pearson late? No, is. Is. Is, is Mr. Pearson late? Sería, no. She isn't late. Teacher, um, yes. In a says the lecture side two, I sería Mrs. Vera. Sería femenino. Number six is Mrs. Person. Yes. Okay. So sería no. She isn't late. No, she is. She isn't. Or she is not. Mm -hmm. Correct. Thanks, Miss. You're welcome. Siete um, sería, am I in the right classroom? Sí. ¿Cuál sería en la siete? Um. Um. Mm -hmm. um. Am I in the right classroom, yes. You are in the right classroom. Yes. You are in the right. You are. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna watch you. Are the children nice? Okay. Are the children? Mm -hmm. Are the children nice? Yes. They are in the they, right classroom. Correcto. They are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Yes. Una nueve. Una nueve. Is Mrs. Person the math teacher? Uh, it, mm -hmm. yeah, is. Is Mr. Person. Teacher, um, with yes. this no. MRS, how the pronunciation? She, which one? Miss. Uh, Mrs. Person oh, or how? Mrs. 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 Person. Mrs. Person, okay. Thanks. Okay. Um, 
Sería la 9. ¿Cuál es la respuesta de la 9? Aquí no podríamos utilizar las contracciones porque estamos haciendo oraciones largas. Sería no is not German. Si no tuviéramos el German, sí si si puede dejar no is. Ajá. Uh -huh. Vale, sí, sí, pueden, perdón. Pueden utilizar contracciones ahí. Eh, sería lo mismo. Estamos en una oración, entonces. ¿Cómo, no, cómo no se oye? ¿Puede repetir en qué ejercicio? Sí, en qué ejercicio. Ejercicio 4. Sí, se puede. Sí, eh, perdón, ¿en qué ejercicio está? Cuatro. En, el, en el ejercicio 2, la línea 4. Ok. Es Peter. Es Peter German. No, he is not German. No, he isn't German. No, he is not German. No, he is not German. Podría ser cualquiera de las tres. Oh, okay. No hay problema. Nada más la regla dice que no se puede utilizar contracción cuando estoy dando respuesta corta en afirmativo. Yes, he is. Yes, she is. Yes, they are. En esa forma corta, con el yes, siempre debe de ir completo, ¿verdad? No puede utilizar contracción. Esa es la única en la que no se puede. Los demás sí. Ok. Gracias, Miss. You're welcome. Ok, entonces la siguiente sería... En la 5 sería... Argeno en Sally. Yes. Are they? Are they? Jenny and Sally. Okay. In their classroom. Yes, we. No, yes, they are. Mm -hmm. In the third classroom. In their classroom. En la siguiente sería. Is Mr. I... Person. Ah, sí, perdón, Mr. Person Lay. Is sería... In the case we have is. Is Mrs. Oh. Mrs. S M R S es para Mrs. que es para una mujer, una mujer casada, para ser específica. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. So it's Mrs. Mrs. Pearson. Mrs. Pearson. Sería no, she isn't. No, she is not late. No, she is not late. No, she is not late. Am I in the right classroom? Am I in the right classroom? The right class. Yes. Yes, I'm in the race classroom. Yes. Yes, you are. You are. The right class. ¿Por qué no podría ser yes, I am? Eh, es lo que decía la Miss, de que es eh, la inversa, la de you. Ah, oh, sí, 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 sí. Ajá, exacto. Para la siguiente sería, are... Are the children rice? Rice, ajá. Are children children nice. Rice. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. Nice. Exactly. Uh, exactly. La siguiente sería. Is. Is. 
Mr. Person. Person. The math teacher. No. La respuesta sería no. No. I no. No. ¿Cómo es she? No, he is not. No, she's not. No, yes. porque no, dijo que sería she. Es Miss. Es, eh, es una señora. Es Entonces sería she. No, no, she. No, she is no, not teacher. Sí. Uh -huh. Teacher. Después de ella sería Are you brother nice? Ajá. Nice. Uh -huh. Y aquí sería el ah, cambio que es. usted mencionó, ¿verdad? Okay. Okay. En esta Exacto. última, your brother, estamos hablando de your brother, sería is or are. Are. Are you sure? Sería It's singular. No. Is sería your no. brother nice? Is. Vamos a utilizar is porque estamos hablando en singular. Your brother. Tu hermano, no. right? Your brother. Si lo tuviéramos en plural, entonces si utilizamos are. Are your brothers? Are your brothers? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Is, is your, brother? your brother nice? Entonces sería no. No, he isn't. He isn't. No, he isn't nice. nice. Ok. Luego están las preguntas y darle pues, forma. La primera sería: ¿Is your fire from Canada? Uh -huh, exacto. Is your father from Canada? Y la larga respuesta sería: Yes. He is, he is from Canada. In my bag. Is otra. You is. ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo? La otra es, is, is my teacher young? Is my teacher young. Ajá, es mi profesor joven. Sí. La tres. Is Anthony an actor, verdad? La tres. Is, uh, is Anton, uh, yo creo que es Anthony, uh, no sé, o Anton, no sé. Lo un actor, Wait till... Waiter. Waiter. ¿Qué significa waiters? No sé si son las zapatas, creo. No sé, no, no recuerdo. No puede ser. ¿Qué es que son... trabajan este? Waiters es meseros. Ah, meseros, ¿verdad? Yes. No, 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 ok. Thank you. Is my mom so pretty? So pretty? So pretty? Sí, is, is my, my mom. mom. Is my uh -huh. mom. So pretty. ¿La otra? Okay. Sí. Is, 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 is the water is, hot? Sí. Water hot. Está el agua caliente, algo así, va a poder. Exacto, exacto. 
Are my models my brothers? School? Are my brothers? Uh -huh. Are my brothers at the school? ¿Están mis hermanos en el, la escuela? En la escuela, ajá. Uh -huh. Is the cat, ¿verdad? The cat in the kitchen. Sí. Uh -huh. Sí. Is the cat in the kitchen, ¿verdad? Está el gato en la cocina, ¿verdad? Ajá. Uh -huh. Are my parents in Germany? Sí, exacto. Are my parents? Are my parents? Ajá. Parents, parents. Is Alan my best friend? Mm -hmm. Yes, that's here. Is, is Alan my best friend? Is Alan mi mejor amigo? Sí. Uh -huh. Terminamos. ¿no? Sí, mira. Ahí estuvo bien trabajar con usted. Por sí, no. <risa> Buen equipo somos. Sí, la verdad que sí. Ajá. ¿Qué pasó? Así como en la ¿Qué fundación pasó? le digo. Ajá. All right, welcome back. How was the practice? ¿Qué tal la práctica? Uh, very good. Was very good. good? Was it easy? So so? Maybe difficult? So so? So so? So so. Okay. I can finish. You couldn't finish. All right, don't worry. We are going to review it and check it all together. So we got number one are Jane and Alice sisters and the questions they, I mean, the answers could be yes, they are or no, they aren't, right? Number two. Is this car yours? Is this car yours? And the answers. Yes, it is. Yes, it is or no, it isn't. Number it three. Isn't. Number three. Am, am, I, I, am I in your way? Am I in your way? Yes, you are. No, you're not. Number four. Is Maria John's sister. Very good. And the answers? Yes. Yes, she, she is. is. Yes, yes, she, she is. is. She isn't. No, no she isn't. No, she isn't. Okay, number five. Are you, are, you are you 25 years old? Are you 25 years old? Yes, I am. No, I am not. Number six is? Are the Smiths divorced? 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 Yes, they are or no, they aren't. Number seven? Is this your new bicycle? Your new bicycle? In the short answers? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Or no? no it no, isn't. It, it isn't. isn't. Good. Number eight? Is she, she is a nice person. Is she a nice person? Is she a nice person? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. Number nine? Am I, am I at the stadium? Am I at the stadium? Yes, you are, or no, you're not. Number 10. Are Sue are and I, I in, the, in the same class? In the same class. Yes. How do we answer? Yes, yes, we are. Yes, we are, or no, we're not. Number 11. Is the cell phone in the back? 
Yes, it is. No, it isn't. And the last one, are the kids outside? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Okay, now let's check exercise number two. Let's see. Carlos, can you tell me number one, please? Carlos Campos. Is that my pen? Continue? No. No, it is not your pen. Okay, very good. Number two, Jose Manuel. I've using, I've using my folders. No, they not your Very good. No, they're not your folders. Se Number escucha. three. Yes. Thank you. Lisette. Lisette Vasquez. Number three. Okay. Are we in the playground? Yes. Uh, yes, are in the playground. We are in the playground. Frank, number four. Repito. Yes, please, I couldn't hear you. Is Peter German? No, he is in German. Very good. Thank you, Frank. Abel Hernandez, number five. Are Jenny and Sally in their classroom? Yes, they are in the classroom. Thank you. Cecilia Imperatriz, Imperatriz, sorry. Next one. Is Mrs. Person late? No, she isn't late. Very good, Cecilia. Maria Carmelina, number seven. And I in the right classroom? Yes, I am in the right classroom. Okay, good. Or also remember that there you could say, yes, you are in the right classroom. So it all depends on the context. Thank you, Maria Carmelina. Rafael, number eight. Are the children at night? Uh, yes, they are night. Thanks. Number nine, Jose Manuel Grijalva. Check your microphone, please, Jose Manuel. Oh, sorry. It's the it is, is Mr. Person the math teacher? No, she is not. Okay, very good. Just here, we pronounce this as Mrs. Mrs. Person. Oh. And remember okay. that is for the woman, the girls that are married. Okay. So okay. thank you. Next one, Alfonso Antonio. Are the brothers nice? Um, No, they aren't nice, they say. They are nice. Okay, thank you. All right, next exercise, please tell me the question number one. Everybody? Your father from East Canada. Canada. Is your father from Canada, number two? Is it a blue car? You see the blue car, number three? Your uncle is very tall. Very tall. Uncle very tall. Is your uncle very tall? Four? Are you a good English? 
you good at English? Are you good at English? That's what we say there. Are you good at English? Five. Is Carla, is Carla, is Carla your best friend? Is Carla your best friend? Number six. Are Mark and Arthur angry now? Hungry now. Are Mark and Arthur hungry now? Or are Mark are Arthur and Mark, right? It could be whichever order you choose. Number seven. Is this your new car? Is this your new car? And the last one is. Are your shoes white and blue? Okay, good. And the last one, we got some sentences and we have to make them interrogative, right? To make them questions. Number one, the books are in my bag. Books are in my bag. Are the books are in my bag? Books in my bag. Number two. Is my teacher John? Three? Is Anthony is a doctor? Number four? Are Mike and Molly waiters? Five? Is my mom so pretty? So pretty. Number six? Is the water hot? Is the water hot? Number seven. Are my brothers at uh, Are my brothers at school? Eight. Is the cat is the cat in the, the, the kitchen? Nine. Uh, my my are my parents in Germany. Germany. And the last one is. Is Alan, my best friend? Is, Alan my best friend? is Alan my best friend? Very good. Do we have any questions about any of the words, maybe the vocabulary, pronunciation, or anything? Tenemos consultas? No. No? Okay, good. So now let's continue by using our students' manual. So please, everybody, go to your manual. And we are working on page number nine. Todos vamos a los manuales. ¿Lo tienen por ahí? Page number nine. We're working on page number nine. And first of all, we are going to practice the pronunciation for this vocabulary. So we got words like maintenance, floor manager, Supervisor, truck driver, engineer, and secretary. Now repeat after me. Maintenance. Maintenance. Floor manager. Floor manager. Supervisor. Supervisor. Truck driver. Truck driver. Engineer. Engineer. Secretary. Secretary. Okay, let, let me ask some of you to pronounce the words. Let's see. Lisette Vasquez, you pronounce this one. Read it. Super. Good. Supervisor. Supervisor. Good. Rafael Alexander. This word, please. Sorry, is it my connection that is not okay? Maybe. You guys, can you hear me? Oh, yes. Okay, thank you. Next one, Alfonso Antonio. Truck driver. Very good. Dalia Margarita, this one. Maintenance. Maintenance, very good. Maintenance. 
Maria Carmelina. Can you pronounce this one? Engineer. Engineer. Arnoldo Moran. This one, please. Check your microphone. Your microphone is off. There you go. Me oye? Yes. Floor manager. Very good. We say floor manager. Okay, let's repeat them once again. Everybody repeat after me. Maintenance. Maintenance. Floor manager. Floor manager. manager. Supervisor. Supervisor. Truck driver. Truck driver. Engineer. Engineer. Secretary. Secretary. Okay, very good. Now let's continue by practicing the vocabulary in exercise number three. We have to unscramble the letters in order to make words. So take a minute to unscramble the words, please. Vamos a ordenar las letras de modo que tengamos palabras. Se refiere también a las occupations. So take a minute to solve that, please. Engineer. Number one, engineer. Number one, engineer. Write it down. Vayan escribiéndolas. Engineer. Complete the whole exercise and then we are going to check. Completenlo y luego revisamos. Did you finish? Yes. Okay, good. Now tell me the word number one is? Engineer. 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 Number two? Yes. Floor, Floor, manager. Manager. Floor, Floor manager. manager. Floor manager. Floor manager. Number three? Secretary. 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 Number four? Uh, driver. 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 Truck driver. Number five? Supervisor. 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 And number six? Maintenance. 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 Okay, Maintenance. let me show you the words. Check that you wrote them correctly. Check, please. Ah, uh, yes, I'm here. Mm -hmm. Did you get them correctly? Yes. Yes. Perfect. You're good students. Okay, let's continue by working on page number 13. Page 
page number 13. Okay, there we go. So first of all, we have a little conversation that we're going to practice. So let me read it for you once and then I'll give you the chance to read it. Um, may I ask you to please and turn your microphone off, please, everybody, so you can listen to me. Okay, so it goes like, hello, I'm Anna Trujillo. Hi, Anna, I'm Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me, is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. She is Mrs. Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay, and are you the supervisor? No, I am not. I am a salesperson. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. That's how it goes. Now repeat after me. Hello. 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 I'm Anna Trujillo. I'm Anna Trujillo. Hi, Anna. Hi, Anna. Hi, Anna. Hi, Anna. I'm Mr. Carlos Lopez. I'm Mr. Carlos, Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. Nice Excuse me. Excuse, Excuse me. me. Is she Miss Diana Andrade? Is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. No, no, she no, isn't. She, isn't. she is Mrs. Diana Aguilar. She is she Mrs. Is Diana, Diana, Diana Aguilar. Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. She, she is, is the manager, manager of, the of the company. Okay. 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 And are you the supervisor? And are and you the supervisor? supervisor? No, I am not. No, no, I am, I am not. not. I am a salesperson. I, I am a salesperson. Sales person. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Thank you Thank so you much, much, Mr. Lopez. Lopez. Okay, now let me ask for volunteers to read the conversation. Do we have any volunteers? Tengo voluntarios para leer. Yo. Yo. So that would be, can you say your names, Yo. please? So we could identify Yo. you. Alfonso. <laughs> okay, Jose Alfonso Manuel. and Jose Manuel. Jose Manuel. Okay, go ahead. Jose Manuel, you can start. Okay. Hello. I am Ana Trujillo. Solo un momentito. Me, eh, estoy sacando lo. Acá. Okay. Hoy sí. Okay. Hello. I am Ana Trujillo. Hi, Ana. I am Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me. Is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. She is Mr. Miss Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay. And are you the supervisor? No, I am not. I am Salas Person. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Very good, thanks. Now, please everybody repeat, Ms. Ms. Mrs. 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 Supervisor. Supervisor. Manager. Manager. Company. 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 Salesperson. Salesperson. Person. Mister. 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 Okay, good. Now let me have another pair to read, please. ¿Quién más quiere leer? Yo. Arnoldo. Okay, Arnoldo. Who else? Yo, Zulma. Sulma. Okay, very good. Sulma, you start. Hello, I'm Ana Trujillo. Hi, Ana. I am Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. 
Excuse me, she's Miss Diana Andrade? No, she is, she is Miss Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay, and are you the supervisor? No, I'm not. I am a person. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Very good. Thanks for reading, Zulma and Alfonso. Let me have another pair. Do we have any other volunteers to read? Anybody? Don't be shy, come on, practice. Okay, let me choose two people then. That will be Rafael Alexander <laughs> and... No. Dalia. Oh, Dalia, okay, thank you. Dalia, you start. Okay, hello, I am Ana Trujillo. Hi, Ana. I, Mr. Miss Carla Lopez, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me, is she Miss Jana Andrade? No, she is. She is Miss, Miss, Miss yes. Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay, and are you the supervisor? No, I'm not. I am a service person. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Very good. Thanks for reading. Okay, now repeat after me. I'm. 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 Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me. Excuse me. Miss. Miss. Mrs. 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 Manager. 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 Company. 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 Supervisor. 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 Salesperson. Salesperson. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mister. 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 Okay, and let me explain about these three words. So we got Mister. We also have Miss. Yes. At four, actually. Then we also have this one, Ms. And we got this one. So the first one is for men. It doesn't matter if they are married or not. La primera es para hombres, Mr. 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 Morales, Mr. Lopez, Mr. What? Rodriguez. So you use it for men. Eso se usa para hombres, sin importar si están casados o no. La segunda, bueno, las demás son para mujeres. La segunda es para mujeres solteras, Miss. Miss. Like you say Miss Mendoza, Miss Mendez, and just whoever you're talking about that is single. La, luego, si no estoy segura, si la persona, o bueno, mejor dicho, la mujer está casada o no lo está, Puedo utilizar este que es neutro, podríamos decir, Miss. Miss. La pronunciación es bien parecida a la anterior, sin embargo, esta lleva un poquito más de vibración. The first one is Miss, Miss. This one is Miss, Miss. Miss. And then we have the fourth one, which is for married woman. La última es para mujeres casadas, Misses. Mrs. Okay, so those are the titles. Repeat after okay. me. Mr. 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 Miss. 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 All right, let's continue. Now we are going to answer some questions with the information we got from the conversation. 
Number one, is Mrs. Diana Aguilar the manager of the company? No, no she's not. No, she's not. Or no, she isn't. No, she isn't. Number two, are Anna and Carlos supervisors? No, they're not. No, they're not, right? Okay, good. Now, we do not have more time. Um, we are going to have a little homework. Let me tell you about it. You have to complete the exercises on page number 14. Completamos los ejercicios de la página 14. The, here you have some information about the yes-no questions and the short answers that we just learned about. And then exercise number five, complete the questions and answers, then compare the answers with a partner. We have an example. Is she Jessica? No. What do we write here? No, no, she's not. No, she's not. She is, is, is Linda. Linda. That's what you have to do. And in exercise number six, you have to complete and practice the conversation with a new classmate. So just complete it on your own. And tomorrow we're going to have some chance to practice it. And that will be all. Um, let me tell you about the platform too. By now, we should complete exercise number two, homework number two. También en la plataforma, voy a pedirles, por favor, que, que completemos la tarea número dos. Sería el ejercicio correspondiente a la tarea número dos. Y los que no han podido completar el ejercicio de la tarea uno, si les pido, por favor, que lo vayamos haciendo para que no nos quede el trabajo para el final de la semana, ¿verdad? Así vamos haciéndolo de forma organizada y vamos aprovechando el tiempo. Teacher, perdón. Tell me. Eh, ¿Y será que mañana nos van a atender a los que no podemos entrar a la plataforma? Sí, yo esperaría que sí. Voy, yo igual voy a, a informar acerca de esto para que estén ahí pendientes. Y sí, disculparme Gracias. ahí porque no les han podido responder, pero de verdad estamos súper llenos ahorita de consultas por el inicio de los cursos y todo eso, entonces se hace un poquito difícil, pero eh, créanme que ya están los chicos trabajando para resolver las dudas y ayudarles siempre. Ok, so that will be all for today's class. Remember about the homework. You should complete um, page number 14 in your student's manual and homework number two in the platform. Tenemos esas dos tareas, página 14 y la tarea número dos en la plataforma. And that will be all. Take care. Have a good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night.